trainer. If you're not doing anything, I've got a few hours free. Would you like to come up? Your cabin is gorgeous. I've seen apartments smaller than this. Oh, an actual shower. The faucets in the women's bathroom are crap, by the way. In any event, I thought you might be in the mood to play. Chess? I bought a board on the Citadel. Gooey interface, not nearly as much fun as real pieces. But I hoped you might give me some pointers. That's funny. I figured you'd be more interested in a shower. I didn't realize that was an option. It's an option. Well, just give me a moment to grab my things. Hot water and room to stretch. I could get lost in here. Mm. Oh, it's like a week's worth of stress is washing off. And the timing's perfect. I was hoping to look nice for somebody. Hot date lined up? Hopefully more than just that. I play for keeps. Sounds serious. That depends on whether she's interested. Well, good luck. Holler if you need anything. Oh! Will do! Thanks again, Shepard. No problem. Take as long as you like. And don't think this saves you from our chess match. <laughs> Just give me a minute to dry my hair. Ha! Oh, come on! <laughs> my word, Commander. It's almost as though you wanted to spare your pawns the indignity of living under my regime. In real life, that tactic would have worked. Well, in real life, one doesn't move on an 8x8 square grid. You know what I mean. The pawns are infantry. A good infantry line like the Krogan can take a charge like that. That reminds me of a joke. What's the difference between Commander Shepard and a Krogan? One is an unstoppable juggernaut of head-butting destruction. And the other doesn't have a smart-ass comm officer to keep her in line. Ooh, that's even better than the number of testicles punchline. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't run back to the lab, trainer. Thanks. So, rematch? Hell yes. 